leases and documentation. Document everything. This cannot be understated. Document your advertisement, contact with the applicant, decision-making process for both accepted and declined applicants. Maintain a copy of the application, verification process, and keep everything confidential. Once an applicant is approved, it's time to create the lease. As of April 30th, 2018, all lease agreements in Ontario must be in writing using the form called the Residential Tenancy Agreement Standard Form of Lease. This document spells out all key information related to the tenancy, such as names of lessees, occupants, rent owing, if there's a rent deposit, if tenant insurance is required, and it provides significant information to the tenants on their rights and the obligations of the landlord. It is important that the information in this document is correct. For example, if you have not collected a last month's rent deposit, then ensure it is stated in the lease. If left blank, you create ambiguity. Errors will be in favor of the tenant, so ensure you complete all sections. A landlord can add an addendum to the standard form of lease to capture other components required, such as window coverings, appliances, water beds, how to obtain maintenance, etc., as well as any building rules that may be applicable. This is where the landlord would include information about condominium rules if the rental is in a registered condominium. A copy of the standard form of lease can be obtained on the Ontario Landlord Tenant Board site or the Ministry of Housing's website.